YouTube, it's the Brick Adjuster here with another episode of Whatever What? In today's episode, we have a question from JTC's Bricks. JTC's Bricks asks, who is the best Bricklink seller? I think it depends on what you are looking for because there are a lot of great Bricklink sellers out there. However, a Bricklink seller may not be that great for certain people if they don't have the parts that that person may need for their mock or collection. Also, if that seller lives in a different country than you, then their shipping rates might be more expensive compared to a seller that lives in your country. However, for best Bricklink seller service, I guess you could always look at the feedback section for a seller that you are considering buying from. Oftentimes, you will see what other buyers are saying about these sellers, good and bad. You may find out that this seller likes to pack their bricks covered with dog hair or that they often spray their bricks with cigarette smoke before mailing it off. Personally, I don't really look at the feedback section much. If a seller has my parts or minifigures that I want and the shipping rates are generally reasonable, I'll pull the trigger and buy from them. That's why I guess I get the smoky bricks with dog hair. So my question to you guys is, who is the best Bricklink seller? Comment below, let me know, and please continue sending me Lego related questions. I love giving my thoughts. So this concludes another episode of Black and Black. This is the Brick Adjuster signing off. Thanks for watching and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye.